Hey there, everybody. Welcome back. This is Bo. So, uh, got a brand new truck, a 2017 Honda Ridgeline, but it comes with one little issue, which kind of, the doors don't really open that wide in the back, which is kind of rough, especially if you're kind of big like me. So they'll open about 24 inches, but there's a solution for this for about 40 bucks and some aftermarket parts. We can actually change out the door stopper and have it go out an extra five inches. So come along and let's get this thing going. The parts list for this is pretty easy. It's two Honda parts, a right and a left. Now these Honda parts I do have in the description below and I'll, fi I'll also give you a link where to find them. They're about 14 to 20 bucks a piece. So you're talking about maybe 30 to $40 depending on where you shop. So these guys right here, and all you're gonna need to install all of this stuff is a ratchet with a 10 millimeter socket, a 13 millimeter socket, a very small standard size uh, screwdriver for popping off some door trim, and one Phillips screwdriver. With that, let's get this puppy going. With the left door open, we're gonna start. See right here, there's a little panel there with a little pop. We're just gonna... Wow, that thing goes flying, doesn't it? And then you'll see one little Phillips screw right in there. Right there. The next panel you gotta pop off, there's this little deal right here. Stick it in there and it'll just pop right out. Come on, dude. At least it's loosened. There we go. And now you have access to the three bolts we need to take off. So we're gonna go ahead and take those off. So the door panel will pop off. It has a bunch of clips and then you'll lift it out. So you just go in here and grab it. I almost need a freaking tool for this. I do need a tool for this, hold on. All right, well, I'm gonna add two more tools to our list. These uh, panel pullers here. So all you gotta do is if you want, <clears throat> here, you just gotta be real gentle and be patient. There we go. These panel pulling tools are worth their weight in gold, guys. Yet. Just be able to lift her out, just like that. And you can let it kind of just chill like that, okay? So the speaker just needs a single screw with this Phillips head to take it off. <laughs> My arm's like right in the way, but I think you guys will live. Some big freaking, oh, it's like, I think they're freaking glued in there. Yep, so you just have to, there's a little clip here, you just have to lift up a little bit and you can detach the speaker. There you go. Freaking speaker finally out. Now let's get to the magic and get that door stopper flip switched out. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna loosen that bolt here and there's two bolts here on the left side. Okay, you see them? Take these, take these out. This door stopper will fall in here. We'll reach up there, grab it, and then we should be good to go. Let's see if I can get a good angle on this. I think that's about as good an angle as we're gonna get. This puppy's really in there, so you might have to use a little bit of muscle to get it out. There we go. There's that one. Now let's put in the other one. So you can see that there is a difference between the two. The left top one is what we're putting in, bottom one is what we're going out. Yeah. <sighs> 
now she opens. A lot wider, a lot wider. Let's go get all this crap put back on there in reverse order, and then uh, we'll see you in a second. All right, and let's go see what happens when you have uh, five extra inches in the back of your car. Oh, truck. Hey, look at that. That's a noticeable improvement. So now you can easily get in here and fit things or stand here. And when I got little dude baby seat coming in here, makes it much nicer. So I recommend this to any of you guys to do. It took me probably 20, 30 minutes. If I wasn't filming, it would have been a lot lot quicker so anyways uh let me guys let me know what you guys thought in the comments below uh like comment subscribe hit the bell and i uh, will talk to you in the next video see ya